The period from the late 17th to early 18th century is known as the Golden Age of Piracy, a time when infamous pirates dominated the seas and left an indelible mark on the trade and politics of that era. This article delves into the adventurous lives of some of the most famous pirates, such as Blackbeard and Anne Bonny, and explores how they were ultimately combated by colonial governments. Pirates lived a free and reckless life, far from the restrictions of society at that time. It was a life full of danger but also of freedom. Many of them were originally sailors or former privateers driven to piracy by various circumstances. Pirate ships were more democratic than most other ships of that time. Crew members often had a say in decisions and shared in the spoils. Edward Teach, better known as Blackbeard, was one of the most feared pirates of his time. With his imposing stature and fiery gaze, enhanced by fuses in his beard that he lit during battles, he instilled fear in everyone. Blackbeard's tactics were not only focused on physical confrontation, he also used psychological warfare to overwhelm his enemies. Despite his notoriety, the details of his pirate life are shrouded in mystery and legend. Anne Bonny, originally from Ireland, was one of the few women who made a name for themselves in the predominantly male world of piracy. She was known for her fiery temper and formidable fighting skills. Together with her partner Calico Jack Rackham, she terrorized the Caribbean. Bonnie's story is a fascinating example of gender roles being overturned in the lawless world of piracy. Piracy had a significant impact on international trade during the Golden Age. Many pirates, such as Blackbeard and Anne Bonnie, targeted merchant ships and plundered valuable cargoes. This led to substantial economic losses and disrupted maritime trade routes. The influence of piracy also extended to politics. Colonial powers like England, Spain and France were often forced to reconsider their approach to maritime security and international policy. The ongoing threat of piracy eventually led to strict measures by colonial governments. The end of the golden age of piracy was heralded by the implementation of the Piracy Act and other stringent laws. These laws made it easier to prosecute and execute pirates. Furthermore, colonial powers strengthened their naval fleets and improved cooperation between different colonies to effectively combat the pirates. Despite their ultimate defeat, the stories of pirates like Blackbeard and Anne Bonny continue to thrive in popular culture. Their adventures capture the imagination and remind us of an era when the seas were still untamed and mysterious.